Garcia Laurel from Dim Days Past, Mr. Ginevra de Something Fidelio. I don't know how many people here are. I don't know how many people And it's called simply a drinking song. You may indeed recognize the tune. In the first Middle Ages, the men they could drink, but women tried it, the men raised a stink. That isn't the way that a lady behaves. Leave the liquor for us, said those self-serving knaves. But now that we know all that women can do, no one can object if they chug one or two. <laughs> when women go forth and do battle with sword, then a lady can surely get drunk as a lord. When a lord goes to all of how much he can hold, his lady should never berate him or scold. But let him discourse till the first light of morn. For while he is boasting, she'll empty his horn. <laughs> the lady who serves as the court's learned scribe ends a wandering line once she starts to imbibe. <laughs> there's beer in the kitchen, there's wine in the food. But the scullery maid is the one who gets stewed. <laughs> The harpist is willing and able to play. In spite of the ale, she's just put away. <laughs> but the music meanders in uncertain key, and the harpist and the harp just cannot agree. <laughs> you can tell the difference. The lady who tipples while working her loom can barely get up and go out of the room. Staggers left and then right as she stumbles to bed. Uh, they don't call us weavers for nothing, she said. <laughs> <laughs> when a squire stops drinking, two things will occur. He's out of the way and there's more wine for her. <laughs> when he's under the table, stretch out on the floor. And that's just what a lady in waiting's waiting for. <laughs> <laughs> a milkmaid can empty a cup with the best, and a good serving when she can out drink her guest. It's plain that a nun can out guzzle a monk, and even a queen can get royally drunk. <laughs> my lords and my ladies, I bid you to think how a lady may best any male at the drink. The bigger the bottle, the more it can take. But a small, sturdy flask is less likely to break. <laughs> so I urge you to raise up your tankers on high, and drink to my toast till your cup it be dry. <laughs> then fill up your goblet again and again, so the ladies will drink to the health of their men. <laughs> <laughs>